Good early morning. Actually, mid morning on this nice, comfortable, slightly humid with high, thick overcast today. Uh, 64 degrees. Had a bad midsummer day and a uh, now mid July in the greater Romeo metropolitan area in the great state of Michigan. Right? It's a nice day out. Gonna have some rain later on and then we get more sustained warmth and humidity as we move through the week. Bitcoin starting to come down. Uh, we'll just do a quick run through. I'm on break. I didn't have a chance to get out to anything today yet. The bullish or bearish indicators went out. I sent a couple single emails out. People said that they weren't on it. But you can see in the far out view, we're crashing, we've been in the shorter time frame that everybody cares about because everybody seems to be a fucking day trader and they're day trade uh, experts and you're all professional day traders on this site, I see. Ah, you can see it's trying to bounce, but every time it tries to bounce, it gets hit down into these moving averages and gets fucking shot down and rejected, right? And in Bitcoin, the moving averages in the hour time frame are all tight. There should be, there could be a pump to 40 at somewhere, but I think now it's looking more like it's going to come back down to 30 first, then go up. But we'll keep an eye on that. Um, if we stroll along into some other nonsense, XRP is forming the same thing. I think it's going to keep coming down into that arrow, like I told you about the other day. And we're going to come retoss the top of this, get my shit together box, and then we'll take it from there. Dogecoin, my company building Dogecoin, everyone's favorite Dogecoin, right? It continues to come down, and Vincenzo thinks Dogecoin is coming down uh, to the bottom of this down trending support at about 16 cents on the oh shit, get my shit together box. That's honestly where I think we're going in Doge. Um, XLM, the same thing. We kind of had that fake out, and now I think we're going to come down to 22 cents and retest. And then maybe touch that, get my shit together box, and then maybe trade down farther into this descending channel that we've been trading in. A lot of people putting out fake news um, on XLM, trying to get people excited, telling you to buy it, and then sell it, and then buy it, and then pay taxes, and then fees and taxes, and all kinds of nonsense. It's coming down here probably, like that. Gonna come down there in XLM, and then CeeLo, after this fabulous, all enticing, glowing double top, we have this W forming and we're gonna come trade back down, forming this topping W patterns. Because W's, see that, are topping reversal patterns. Or M's, this is a big M, right? M's are topping reversal patterns. W's are um, bottoming reversal patterns, right? And then Quanta, you can see it continues to come down because we told Brian Stewart it would. Same with CLO, like, subscribe, and share.